I am playing Mario Galaxy in the middle of the night. For really no reason. Just to do it, I suppose. Oh, I love the face cam loading in after the frame there. That's fun. Um, yeah, playing on my genuine, authentic Nintendo Wii. Uh, no, uh, but I've just, I've had so many issues uh, with the stream and stuff recently. My headphones stopped working. There's this gremlin that infected Game Bar. I, I'll talk about it more later, maybe if um, real viewers join. Um, but I'm playing Mario Galaxy. I I don't care. On my Wii remote. <laughs> yes, we will start a file. Gotta go with the Yosh, right? I feel like that's... This is what we gotta do. I'm not gonna go with, like, Screaming Toad or anything. Just keeping that pointer centered right in the middle of the screen. Uh, they really do make you use the motion control for a lot of stuff in this game, huh? <clears throat> well, I did play Mario Galaxy 2, but I never played Mario Galaxy 1. I thought I positioned my camera well. I did not. Every hundred years, a comet appears in the skies above the Mushroom Kingdom. The comet was so large one year, it filled the skies and sent down countless shooting stars raining down. I didn't read that right, that's fine. We're just gonna keep going. The toads brought the shooting stars to the castle where they became a great power star. Uh, what, what voice? I don't know. It should have been a very happy time for the citizens of the Mushroom Kingdom, but of course it wasn't Bowser's here, right? There was a festival, yada yada, blah blah. You get the gist. Where's Bowser? Oh my god, hello Peach. That's voice acting. Thank you, Peach. Okay, I hope this control scheme, like, works. I don't know, I'll see. Uh, I, I managed to get the, like, star bit thing cursor thing to hide on the screen eventually um, so if I don't touch it, it, it will just piss off, which is nice <clears throat> I don't remember if there's a run button in these games and like I said I, I only played Mario Galaxy 2 not Mario Galaxy 1 is this Bowser? Her yeah, he just appears hello that sounds horrible on these headphones I'm using like recording headphones for streaming, which I, I genuinely shouldn't. These are like awful to use for video games. The spatial audio is all wrong. Um, they're also open back, so I can like hear the TV in the other room. It's great. But I, I am playing Mario Galaxy. Just briefly for one moment. Oh, the nostalgia in that, in just that alone. It, like, breaks my brain. <clears throat> I did not have a functioning Wii for a very long time. Um, I always decided to just overheat and die one day. I think I was trying to do the, like, endless set list or whatever in, uh, Rock Band 2. <laughs> and the Wii just died. It ate it. It was like, I've had enough. <laughs> I'm done. Oh my god, this cutscene. I can't believe I actually went to see the Mario movie. Like, and I thought it was gonna be, like, at least okay. It was, it was, like, petrifyingly bad. I, like, I don't know what they did with the animation for Peach that it just looked like every female animated character from, like, every, the last movie. All of the movies in the last, like, 15 years? I don't know. It was just awful. <laughs> that was a terrible shot, too. Okay, I don't know what's going on. What's this guy with the spear? Hurry to the princess, sure. We need the star bits, I want them. It's so hard to control this. Where is the princess? Can you go up here? Oh, there's a road. <laughs> so we'll see how well I can navigate in just basic ass 3D Mario game. My guess is poorly. Um, but... Who needs roads when I can just run straight at the princess? Yeah. I don't think the B button is a run button. 
There must be, though, right? Maybe I just don't have access to it because it's like the starting thing. That is just a spaceship, huh? <clears throat> I mean, I guess that's like the whole point, right? It just, it looks so out of place with the regular Mario-like sky ships and the spaceship. It is Mario Galaxy, after all. I'm just like role-playing like it's 2007, and I've never seen this before. But I, I genuinely have only played like a tiny bit of this game. I, on a friend's disc as a kid, and now just like a tiny bit getting it set up here for the stream. Um, this is kind of a sick cutscene for 2007. Um, kind of looks horrible now, but interesting like weird dithering textures and stuff there. <laughs> just four ships. That bridge is in some shape, huh? Oh, it just popped into place! Surely the cutscene will end soon? Oh, we're actually aboard the castle, huh? That is... a voice line. My god. Kamek. And off we go. We, we did not land on the castle. In the end. I know that there's this big, like, spaceship that you could be on with Rosalina, right? <clears throat> That's like the hub world. Oh, those flowers look great. Nintendo Wii, very good. I want to see if I can get Sunshine going as well. That is a game I would like to play eventually. I have never played Mario Sunshine either. <clears throat> big fan of Odyssey. Galaxy 2. Well, I started streaming and my throat is all of a sudden just destroyed. Hang on. And of course, I just maxed out the level for the voice, too. Great, I'm doing great. Well, there's no one here, so it doesn't matter. I'm just practicing. <laughs> Let's play. Jump with a... I don't know how much of this I'm going to play tonight, but, um, play some of it. Gotta catch the rabbits. Sure. Oh, that was weird. <laughs> the noise of him sliding off the roofs is funny. Nice. Okay, um, I'm rabbits, huh? Oh, that's a butterfly. Oh. Found one of them. Oh my god, controlling this in 3D space is actually kind of hurting my head already. <laughs> but I got the rabbit, okay. In the crater, huh? That must be where the other one is. That's how these games go. Oh, yeah, I guess, huh? Get the rabbit. I'm holding what should be the B button. Oh, that seems to do it, actually. I can't tell. If I've just been holding run for long enough, I don't know. Two rabbits. Okay, one more. In the pipe. There's a pipe. I didn't see a pipe. I like start doing a voice and then I can't stop. That's not ideal. Oh, 3D space. Very good. Oh, 
There we go. Caught that one a little easier. That was a crunchy tune that it played. We have proven ourselves to the Luma. Let us go. Why go the way that you're supposed to go? That would be lame. <laughs> Hello, Rosalina. A character I genuinely had no idea who it was. My friend, like, plugged his Mario Galaxy disc into my Wii to unlock Rosalina, and I was like, who is this character? <laughs> I was very big into Mario Kart Wii. As a kid. Sure. <clears throat> We're gonna eat stars. No, oh, right. We get the spin now, right? At least I think. Oh shit, I don't know if I have that active. Uh oh. I'm gonna have to find out if I can spin or not. If I can't spin, that might just be it for the stream. <laughs> that would be pretty pathetic. I could play like Rhythm Heaven or something, but... I mean, shaking this is not gonna do shit. Uh, I don't... Oh man, okay. Well, it's not like anybody's waiting on me, controllers. Let's see. like a shake thing specifically. Um, of course, as soon as I get somebody in here, I am just dicking around with settings because I can't figure out how to shake. Maybe... No, I think I do literally need it to break the Luma out. Okay. Well... I might literally not be able to get past this because my stupid emulator I didn't get set up properly. <laughs> no, spoiler, this is not a real Wii. Um, motion simulation, let's see. I don't know if I can tilt and swing. I don't think that's going to do anything. Dead. Okay. Hang on. I, I will do a quick Google and see if I can fix it. And of course I get like super tired as soon as I start streaming because I'm a dumbass. Why did I decide to do this at 11.30? Oh, um... There's a shake under the extension? Advanced? Okay, no, I don't see shake there. Extension motion simulation? Shake! Oh my god, okay. Sure, so I'll just push in the left stick for shake, that's fine. That works. 
Oh, okay, I got it working. Look at that. <laughs> Several years of <laughs> computer science, and I can I barely <laughs> test tiny little things. There we go. Star. Ooh. Game goes a chug. Because my computer's probably infected with some viruses. Either that or Game Bar just, like, shat its pants. I'm genuinely not sure which it is. Um... But I... It, it can't be good, these ROM sites. Actually, I kind of like that being, um... bound to... uh, L3 or whatever. That feels pretty good. Nice. Thought it was gonna be a one-up and then just an immediate death. But no. God, it feels so nostalgic. I, I played the hell out of Mario Galaxy 2. But, yeah. This is really my, like, first experience. Those Goombas look awful. <laughs> to be honest. The background is kind of questionable, too, but... Well, that was cool. You can't skip any of that dialogue. It just- it goes the speed it wants to go. Who has the key? You have the key. Yeah, you're like a different color guy. Wonderful. <laughs> I love how the Lumas just like turn into stars too. Sure. I always like the Lumas in these games. The like ship captain one in the second game is really funny. I'm really only playing Mario Galaxy 1 so that I can play Mario Galaxy 2 later. <laughs> but, um, I'm sure this one's fun too. I like these, like, rods that I can spin into. It's kinda cool. I feel like there was a way to, um... Stop enemies with the um, with the pointer as well, but I have not figured out how to do it. And now the pointer is behaving strangely, of course. Now that I got the shake working, so oh, it's the big Goomba, huh? Bonk him! There we go. Yeah, it is hard to control this, my goodness. There we go, star bits acquired. Probably no need to hoover all the star bits, but I will try. Anyway, just, just to do it, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, some of those backgrounds look really crusty. There we go, made it in the pipe a bit easier that time. Oh, the, the curvature is a little funny on that, the brain. It's making something, huh? All right. It's just a classic Mario puzzle of touch all the buttons. Yep. Guessing there are more around the room like that one was? Yeah. Can't walk on that until it passes, that's fine. Okay, are you- is this the last one? Yeah. I mean, I don't really have much to say for the, like, starting stuff in these games. It's kind of pretty basic, but these games get fun later on. I remember the boss fights in Galaxy 2 were some of my favorite parts. There was like a giant worm, um, and some other stuff. It was pretty cool.
I got a grand star. It didn't really feel very grand, but it's a star. Mm. Here we go. I, I recognize this. A cool thing that they designed. Cool like shit. This genuinely does look pretty good for 2007. Um, all things considered. But I guess I play a, a fair few games that are from that era, huh? Not surprising, as, as that was like the age for me. Um, oh, and we get access to more and more of the ship as time goes on, right? I I think I gathered the way this works, but I'm not sure. Got 38 star bits. Galaxies discovered. All right. Mario <laughs> just looks so chunky. His design is always so funny. I think they tried to make him spherical in this game, right? So that his hitbox... Like, that's why he's so short and fat in this game, is actually so that his hitbox could be a sphere, so it was easier to make him rotate, which is just really funny to me. I don't know why, I like rubbed my eye once, and now I like got eye goo in my eye, and now I can't see. Fucking dumbass. <laughs> sure, Rosalina. Let, let me play the goofy game, come on. Oh, it's, of course, Bowser, right? Yeah, <laughs> yep. When in doubt, evil turtle man. Please. <laughs> this is the only- please. It's the only word she gets to say. I love the that like Nintendo game thing where they'll just do one word. It very much reminds me of like Wii Fit uh, and Wii Sports and stuff. They did stuff like that. Sure. God, I remember the yeah. Sure, we'll save. Why not? The B power up in the second game. I remember being really fun. Oh, my computer controller is freaking out, apparently. Sometimes the um, control sticks on the PS5 controller uh, have a bit of a hard time. It's kind of sad. Like, I, I thought that they would be much better than they are. I used to be so bad at doing the triple jumps when I was a kid. I don't know why. It's, like, not that hard at all. I guess my timing was just worse in general. I kind of spent a few years actively trying to improve my timing in, in just many aspects. <laughs> oh god, yeah, the sections where I have to use the, the control thing are going to be rough. Kind of like the way they're doing this so far. Let's go there, why not? Oh, this is like the first mini-boss, right? This big egg. Evil energy. Yeah, I wonder if it's big egg. Is the evil energy. There must be a better way to rig this so that I can actually, like... Like, this has a gyroscope in it. I must be able to rig it somehow. I'll try to figure that out off-stream. I was just... I kind of had it set up to play Mario Kart. I should have just done that today. Like, Mario Kart Wii. Just a random Mario Kart stream. But no, we gotta kill the dino piranha thing. Why not? Oh, see, this feels like Galaxy. Oh, the, like, physics are weird. I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm used to Odyssey. I don't know. I 
I set a dead zone on the controller and I kind of regret having done that. It's not doing so great. What? You can't ground pound that? That's a little odd. Yeah, now my pointer is just not working. Oh, there it is. Sure. Oh yeah, it's struggling. Okay. What exactly am I doing on this planet? Uh, I know I was going to the star. I guess it's just up, huh? Oh, I just right, just walk up the wall. I why didn't I think of that? Can I go up there yet? Oh, I have to talk to you first. Lame. <laughs> I'm honestly already having fun. I I miss the like era of Wii games. I've been really enjoying kind of digging through some of the like Wii games that I weird messed up Wii games that I played as a kid. There was one called Endless Ocean that kind of like freaked me out as a kid. Um, and then of course Subnautica came out and like all the like Markiplier <laughs> playthrough videos and stuff happened and I have like narrowly avoided getting hit by these things so many times already. Um, and I was like, oh, I'll never play that game. And then finally, like, less than a year ago, I actually went and played Subnautica, and it was horrifying. I hated it. <laughs> but I, I played it through all the way. I had to, like, take breaks a couple times. But I, I conquered it. Definitely, if I have a phobia, it is the Thalassophobia. Just open ocean is, like, the scariest thing. I don't know how people can, like go scuba diving and stuff and not see what's out there. That's just crazy to me. It's like, and people like die doing that, like uh, regularly. Oops. Gaming. I think that was that the first death. Oh, yeah, it was. That was a really dumb death, too. OK. It's like trying to go in this pipe. Yeah. Oh god, yeah, the camera is a bit to get used to, huh? Very difficult puzzle, I wonder what I do. <laughs> okay, well at least there's more to it. jump and then reactivate it like you can in um, 3D World, which is a little weird. I was playing that in Bowser's Fury not too long ago, um, a couple months ago, like pretty close before I started streaming. Um, and those games are fun, but did I get stuck in the sand? That was not the way I was expecting that to shake out. I don't know what these footsteps are. Should I spin? Yeah. It's the, st the star bit gremlin. Sure. Why not? I, yeah, this pointer is so scuffed right now. In its current state. Yeah, so the coin economy is like kind of changed in this game. If I remember correctly, it's like a hundred star bits is a life instead of a hundred coins. And coins are like much rarer, but they, they act as like hearts. Like you pick up a coin and it heals you. I mean, an interesting concept, I guess. I don't hate it inherently. Oh yeah, it's gonna be hard to get all of these consistently. Oh, I missed one. How dare I? Egg. Oh, we bonk it with its own tail, right? Must be. Yep. Bonk. 
is actually kind of a cute thing. I love Nintendo bosses. They're always just so iconic. Yeah, I like the like crusty pixel edge look of the Wii games. I don't know. It like definitely looks worse on modern monitors than it did on like the TV when I was a kid, but I still like I like the way it looks for some reason. I know it's like objectively bad too. Like it look it's crusty as hell, but I don't know. I that being said, I think like Mario 64 honestly looks really awful a lot of the time. I've never played that one either, so I can't attest to how it feels. I've heard the controls are questionable at best. Oh my god, that is a nostalgic thing. It's the first Power Star we see. These games do such a, a great job of, um, what is this? Like, it's like floating above the ground? What is that weird thing? Yeah, look at that. What is up with that? Can I shoot star bits? Oh, I can. Oh, that's a way to get a coin to heal, huh? Wild. Okay, sure. Get the star. Oh, and I think we see the next thing that we're gonna do in the background there. Nice touch. The, like, menu sounds and stuff just feel really good in these games, too. Nintendo always nailed stuff like that um, in a way that I feel like other game companies didn't. Sometimes the UI stuff can be really questionable. Looking at you, Breath of the Wild. <laughs> um, and then they just, like, leaned into that UI stuff for uh, Tears of the Kingdom, and I was like, why? That game was really good. And then it I don't, I don't know, the controls and stuff. And it just became very same, like a lot of open world games. I think open world games inherently just kind of suffer from their own existence. I don't know. I just wasted a few. Sure. Meanwhile, this guy's talking about star bits. Yum. Yeah, I... It's kind of hard to operate the whole motion control thing. Yeah, let's head back here. Why not? I think we have to. Uh, until we can go to the next galaxy. I just do like a galaxy or two tonight. Whatever. Just kind of hanging out. I was like, I do not want to, like, go fight Radon in Elden Ring tonight. Um, which was the other game that I was playing, and I, I also just, like, was kind of not having a good time playing TF2 either. Um, so I was like, you know what, I'll just start Mario Galaxy. Just, like, the goof-off 3D Mario game, whatever. Okay, I was gonna say, I feel like I've been here recently, and that's because this is where we just were. Does the, um, ground pound just straight up not work on that? That's crazy. Nintendo, what? It's like breaking a cardinal rule of Mario. Car I don't think cardinal rule is the thing. I, I just combined, combined, combined. Great, I'm, I'm just doing so good today. The words and everything. Right, that's just more star bits. Oh, I, probably this pipe is new. One of my least favorite things that I say is probably, like, what is that? That's not a word. <laughs> That's, it's, it's just, it's an atrocity is what it is. I always like the little things that you chase the music notes. I don't really know why. It's executed pretty well in um, Odyssey, specifically. With the, like, speed, um, flowers and stuff. What is that noise? Oh, the, it was actually gonna expire, huh? You have to run towards it? 
sure. Why not? <laughs> oh, and I put you on top of a house, huh? Sure. Just tutorialize whenever you feel like it, says Nintendo. I don't know if my controller is just breaking. It just like suddenly doesn't want to register anything. Okay, so this is different this time. There is no star here. Genuinely not entirely sure what to do, but I'm sure it will become clear. Oh, oh, wait, do I actually have to walk to the end of that thing that I just ignored last time? I think I do. That's pretty funny. Yep. I was like, I know what's there. I didn't know what was here. Oh, this is going to be... Interesting. Okay. Not sure why it, like, sent me back. There we go. It's probably, like, an alternate thing you can do there that I missed. <laughs> From the looks of it, but that's fine. I don't need to do all the secrets and stuff on the first try. been so much going on in my life. I don't even know what to talk about on stream from what's been going on. It's just all been insane. Just working with the craziest people doing crazy stuff and having a really good time. Oh, I guess I did miss something there too, huh? Well, nice, nicely done. <laughs> it's just star bits. I don't care, to be honest. Um... All stars definitely feel a little different in this game from how they did in um, Galaxy 2. I, you can definitely tell that it's like a little bit less refined. Again, I should have been spinning. I remember some of this. You need a hundred. I think I have a hundred. No, I don't. You can have 50 for now. Oh. I don't know why it's so satisfying to lump the Goombas. I would have them spinning around like that, but it is. It just is satisfying. This, these games kind of nail the, like, cozy vibe in a way that many try and few, like, succeed, I would say. A lot of people will ride for games like um, Stardew Valley and stuff like that, which I'm sure are good. But it's just not really my thing. There we go, let's actually do that this time. Oh, it's just more Star Bits. Sure. Why not? Maybe not? I feel like I've been here before. This island. Gravity doing great. Yeah, I have been here. Sure. the most meticulous control that I have to try to use over that. It's fine. I guess they want you to just feed the Luma, huh? Oh, okay. Sure. And that takes me back here. Why not? Yeah, they're sending you on, like, a star bit collecting expedition. 
that should definitely be enough, because I gave him 52. And I'm not a doctor, but I'm pretty sure two numbers bigger than 50 equals more than 100. Is that going to take me back to the guy that I can give Star Bits to? Yeah. I always liked how they got, like, a little bit chunkier the more Star Bits you fed them. I don't know why, it's just a fun thing. There we go. It's a whole planet now. Yeah. It's kind of implied that that's like, yeah, the way planets are made, which is just so goofy. I love it. These games are so, like, lazy fair with the writing in a way that is just awesome. Like, they're just like, yeah, just run around the, run around the planets and have fun. Like, it's, it's, what story? You want his story? No. This is Mario. We, we use the same story every time, which is Bowser bad. Uh, go to lunch. That's it. That's, that's the whole thing. Must be a way to use this, yeah. Brain thing to bonk the Goomba, but I'm not gonna waste time trying. I wanna like throw Cappy like you can in Mario Odyssey. That's not a thing in this game. It's just sad. They should add like there should be like a mod that adds Cappy to Mario Galaxy. I, I bet that's a thing that exists, to be honest. In the realm of things that exist. Oh, that was like, super delayed. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't bind this to the left stick, but something else. Either way, it's fine, to be honest. I just need to remember what I've bound it to. It's the crucial part, it seems. Now we go in the weird pill building. Building? Planet? Whatever. There was lots of stuff like this in Galaxy 2. If I remember correctly. I seem to remember, like, corralling enemies to, like, give them to a robot on a planet shaped like this, and it was frustrating. Classic Mario thing. Really in, uh, good ingenuity with the way that they handled gravity and stuff in these uh, levels. I I admire how much programming it must have taken to get this stuff to just function on a base level as well. It's kind of crazy to think about. I see. I want to go up there somehow. Maybe I don't? There must be a way up. Not even really sure exactly what I'm looking for right now. Oh, I see. What I'm supposed to do? You have to wait for those things to go by? I have to get, go all the way around again? Which is really not that big of a deal. Here we go. So just be patient here. Okay. I want that one up, of course. Nice. Okay, that was a little weird, but if it works, something, something, I don't know. I'm going back down the way I should be going up. Hey, how's it going? Game chatter. I don't know how long ago you messaged, but thank you for messaging in chat. I appreciate it. Just playing some Galaxy tonight. 
just kind of to do it. Oh my god, these planet physics or something else? Okay. There we go. So I guess I like go up to this one and then... There we go. Very nice. That's star number two. I guess there's just one more in this galaxy. I don't think I want to play for too long tonight. I'm pretty tired, actually. Like, it took me long enough to get started streaming that, like, half my energy for the stream was gone. I was like, damn. That's unfortunate. Um, but it is pretty late, so... Yeah, they are something else, huh? Oh god, I'm, like, dragging my monitor cord around under my desk. What am I doing today? <laughs> Stream is a mess. Let's do one more Power Star, and then I might call it for the night, because I'm bloody tired. My eyes are rebelling. <laughs> Looking at the computer screen, they're like, I don't want to. I don't know what's going on with my, um... controller either, but let's get that last star. And then I might be uh, convinced to play more of this game tomorrow, but I might actually go back and fight Radon in Elden Ring. Um, if I have the energy for it. I got really close the end of my last Elden Ring stream to fighting Radon. I was, I was not summoning anyone, <laughs> so that was, that was fun. Okay, I see the star is on top of that building. I'm just gonna go in like orange pipe again, right? So I should grab the bits, but who has time for that? Is this just like a one up or something? I guess it's worth getting. My sins are even worse than that. It is Dolphin, but you like my Wii Remote? <laughs> this is this is a cardinal sin. Don't do this. Oh shit, I'm losing my 1-up. Oh, I got it. It's like playing Dark Souls 1 on a, a Switch, which I have done, and I kind of want to do on stream as well. But yeah. We're just- we're breaking all the rules. Also, I- I bound this one to A. I don't care. I bound that one to A. I'm evil like that. Nintendo doesn't get to control me. <laughs> I mean, and I would have, um... I have a GameCube controller. Um... I just- I don't have the, like, adapter for my computer for it. Um... My friend gave it to me when we were all getting into playing Smash. Um, what am I doing on this island? I have no idea. There's Toad. Ah, I see. I just hate coconuts. Oh, hey, how's it going? Yeah, I want to get the uh, adapter for the Switch um, to play some uh, some Smash with friends on stream eventually. Who was my number one in Smash? If I was trying to win, my number one in, like, ultimate was always Ganondorf. And then just use the Smash attacks. And, and that was just the go-to. Um, but I really liked playing Game & Watch, and I wouldn't, like, spam the the judge move and, and try to go for nines or anything. I just, I don't know, I liked his aerials. Uh, but he was very light. Um, 
It's like 20 bucks? Yeah. I just, um, haven't gotten around to it. There's a lot of peripherals to buy for this whole streaming thing. I have the capture card and all that set up so that I can do stuff from the PlayStation or record Bloodborne, which was real good fun. Um, that is, I mean, that is like my favorite game, so... Yeah, the cursor just doesn't want to wake up sometimes. I don't know what... Oh, don't die to like a random Goomba. There we go. Thank you for the coin. I'm trying to think of the other characters I liked to play in Smash, like, at all. Uh, I, I wanted to enjoy, like, Mewtwo, but it was, um... He was all floaty and weird for my tastes. Um, there we go, right in the face. Okay, I guess that was all I needed to do. Yeah, one of the next things that I'm I'm looking to get uh, for this whole stream is um, another hard drive so that I can store more uh, VODs on my computer and edit more videos together. So I am running out of hard drive space, having to delete stuff all the time. Luigi was really fun in Smash. I like to play him. It was really funny to, like, upbe people off screen. Um, Oh. Hello, gravity. This is like a Korok seed in Tears of the Kingdom. Um, but again, Luigi is like really slippery in a lot of games. I... I've never been one to enjoy ice physics in games, and so... I have a slight qualm with Luigi on that front uh, in many games, but he's not too bad in Smash. He's B-tier according to the official tier list. Okay, well that's good to know. He's B-tier. Um, I always wanted them to add Waluigi, but uh, they never they never will, so there's no even like, there's no helping or anything. It's just, it's like decided at this point. Why would you do this, Miyazaki? <laughs> yeah, I, I always like Luigi as a character, though. He's fun, in general. It's a charming personality. Oh, I see. Yep. Nice. She's got like a... Yeah, there will never be a Waluigi in Smash. I know. We all know. Yeah, I, I have no idea what the Smash tier list stuff looks like. It lo I don't know. I, like, genuinely, the last time I played Smash, like, seriously, was before, like, at least half of the DLC characters came out. We were playing when Piranha Plant came out. Um... And, like... They added Sephiroth and fucking Minecraft- They added Steve into Smash before... Like, that was real. They added Steve into Minecraft, and Waluigi still gets no love. I don't... What... What timeline are we in? Dude, I don't understand. There is big danger ahead. Okay. Thank you, tutorial. Luma, I appreciate you. Have... Have food. Why not? Mmm, yummy. I get my... Pointer is just wigging out. Almost all of the DLC characters are S tier, almost like Bayonetta in Smash 4. It's like they never learn the lesson of like overtuning DLC characters. I, it must be intentional to like sell more copies, right? Oh, I just like spun early in it. There we go. Like it's it, everyone knows that's like scummy behavior. And they'll do it anyway. This is like a weird shaped planet. So every other one is a coconut, huh? Oh, we're playing catch, huh? Or tennis or something? Is Sephiroth is B? I'm honestly surprised. It seemed like he had crazy range, the videos that I saw of it. Um, around when he came out. Um, I 
Yeah, Terry's A tier. That's pretty funny. He seems like a weird character. I think Donkey made a video on him, right? Donkey's videos are generally pretty entertaining. He <laughs> put a video out like a week ago that was like, I'm not quitting YouTube. Um, I think I'm going to make some more videos. And then it just cut. That's it. That's the whole thing. Like, I. Donkey. I'm glad that we have somebody in the community like Donkey. I just. Hmm. Quality. Okay. I I could be convinced to play for a bit more, even though I'm like falling asleep. I'm like my brain is like just just a little more Mario, come on, please, just just a little bit more. I just I need I I just need one more level. That's it. Yeah, there's got to be a better way to get um this whole oh, my motion control thing can't access the top of the screen. That can't be good. character do I care about? I mean... I don't know. Genuinely? I... Smash is one of those games that's like fun to have around, but... If you get too invested in it, then it's, it's time to like take a step back and like smell some fresh air, you know? <laughs> um... Uh, I always thought it was cool when there were heavy characters that were high tier. Uh, people who could do well with DDD or, um, like Bowser and stuff. I always thought that was cool. Especially, like, doing well with low tier characters was fun. I had a friend, shout out to Ocean Man, uh, who was just always incredible at Samus. Um, and it just instinctively made me hate that charge shot because I, I just never was ready for it. This is gonna say how to, like, rotate the camera, right? Yeah. I, I would bet money that's what that sign says. Um, I literally like... Oh, there it is. I don't know why... It, it was like there was a line at the top of the screen. Kazuya is the, like the heaviest character that's, that's good. That's... Yeah, see, that's sad. King K. Rule was really fun. It, I don't know how good Samus is, to be honest. Um, but that charge shot was nasty, and Samus has some some messed up aerials too. It, it can't be too OP. Probably not would be my guess. But I always I always gotta shout out my friend. Um, let's see. Is the B power up in this game? the power up. I feel like I remember the water turns off the B power up somewhere. Oh, I just like, yeah, I just went the wrong way. Classic. Oh, that thing looks kind of crusty. I love it. Also, these beetle enemies are great, too. Look at their, look at their eyes. Look at that. It's like, a thing is too cute. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Let me never do that again. That made me sick. Wonderful. Okay. Um. Okay, so I need to... Give me the B. I really thought this was only in Galaxy 2, but I, I was just wrong. Galaxy 2 has, like, the spring power-up and the rock power-up. Those are cool. I like both of those. There's another one up back here. Yeah. Oh, what? I fell in the poop chute. <laughs> I, I promise I didn't mean to do that. Can you climb on surfaces in this game, or is that a thing that you can only do in the next one? 
Maybe that's what it is. It's like not as good in this game. I do not know. This, no, not the spring power up. I was I was referring to the rock power up and the um the rock power up and uh yeah that one. That's the one that I like. It's the rock power up. The spring power up is heinous. Um. Oh, don't die. That would be silly. Um. A? I mean, A is solid. You can't can't hate to be an A. Um. I don't know. We, we live in such like a tier listed society at this point. Every, everything is broken out into a tier list. How how good certain things are comparing to other things. I don't know. Especially with stuff like Smash. Like, I feel like you gotta just pick the character that you gel with the most. Um, that was my philosophy. I don't know, though. Some of those games have more of a culture of, like, tr specifically trying to win, which is, like, if that's what you want to do, that's cool, too. Like, aiming for excellence is great. That ain't me, though. I can't even get the spin starter work. Um, oh no, yeah, I bet we can climb on the honey. I have to take the risky... It's just stop it. That's it. Just played Bowser for 200 hours. Yeah, I would... my I would play with my friends and I would just pick Bowser. And then I, I would just, like, Bowser-side people over and over, and they got pretty tired of me doing that. So then I found other characters that I could do similar things with. And after a while, I think I, I eventually decided to actually learn how to play the game. But I, I was not, um, not excited to do so, you know? This is cute. I like Mario as a bee much more than I like most bees. Well, I guess specifically hornets in real life for the ones that are bothersome, but I get the worst yellow jackets. Just wherever I am, they just follow me, I swear. Um, and they're just like little devils. I don't know. Yeah, down B spiking people, that, that stuff's really fun. I liked Donkey Kong for the command grab and the spikes. Because Donkey Kong has a couple spikes that he can do. Um, and I, I really liked his down B spike, actually. That one was super satisfying to land. Oh, what am I doing? Um... Yeah, I mean, every character that has a spike... I, I feel like Ganondorf... Yeah, the, the down air that Ganondorf has is like the classic... Like Captain Falcon spike. Um... Oh, that was weird. Oh, this is a weird, like, side quest. You have to, like, de-itch the Queen Bee. That's... yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Off we go. Oh, our, we're the silliest soldiers, so we must do the goofiest battle. God, that texture on... Um... On the B looks like the same texture that they used for Sip in Dark Souls 1. Like the just awful dog coat. <laughs> yeah, Ganon was just a Cap Captain Falcon clone to start. Um, I think I found that out at one point and I was like, really? And yeah, <laughs> duh. Um, but I, um, I kind of like. I don't know, I played Smash Brawl once as a kid, um, with friends, like, at some random person's house that I, like, knew tangentially through, like, Boy Scouts or something. Um, but, like, I never was, like, playing Smash as a kid, um, so I, I didn't, like, have Smash knowledge. Like, I did the other Nintendo game stuff, like, I played tons of Mario Kart and decent amount of Zelda and some of the stuff like that as a kid, but... I don't know. Yeah, and then I went to college and I, I lived with uh, three dudes who were all super, like, smash heads. And, um... 
Yeah, Ganon is really fun in Ultimate, I will say. I like his aerials, I like all of his moves. They're all all good. Um, except I am constantly accidentally up tilting <laughs> the last couple times I played. Let's see, it's been an hour. It's pretty late for me. Um I gotta go look and see what the new galaxy is though, of course. <laughs> this dialogue is is something. Yeah, Sunshine is I've heard it's really good. I haven't pl actually uh, played Sunshine. I was mentioning I want to stream that eventually. Um but I, I gotta get through um, Elden Ring on stream, and then all the DLC is gonna come after that, and then I gotta do Dark Souls. I get Demon Souls, Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3. I wanna play all that stuff on stream, and then I'm gonna play as many, like, old Mario games and Zelda games and random crap. Uh, Mario, your name is Mario, isn't it? <laughs> the perfect emote. What emote is that? Oh my god, stinky glitch. Yes. Yeah, that is that is exactly the face. <laughs> um, yeah, let's let's I guess just go briefly look at the new galaxy, and then that'll be it for tonight. But um, thanks for stopping by the stream. Uh, I had a good time tonight, uh, just goofing around in Mario Galaxy. Oh, it's that, huh? Yeah, I will leave that for next time, but we have more fun stuff to do the next time I play Mario. Uh, thanks for catching the stream. Uh, I would appreciate it if you could give me a follow. I have some stuff up on YouTube and goofy stuff. I don't know if you've heard of TF2 or anything like that, but I upload some stuff for TF2. Um, never look up Mario Sunshine on YouTube. Perhaps I will take your advice. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Um, it's always fun to have new people come in here, so thank you so much. We're gonna hit affiliate soon, and, and we'll see where it goes from there. But that's all for tonight, and I'll catch you next time. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. <laughs>